Dustin Johnson is without question a very modern golfer, a supreme athlete whose long hitting and improved wedge game has allowed him to become a two-time major champion and top the world rankings. Dustin sits at the 20th position of world's highest paid athlete, but are you curious to know about how he has amassed all his wealth, his lifestyle, and gorgeous wife? Stay tuned. Welcome to 24 Golf, your daily dose of golf content. Today we will talk about Dustin Johnson's net worth, earnings, real estate deals, and incredible lifestyle. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Let's get started. Dustin has been the number one ranked golfer in the world for 64 whole weeks. This has been the longest that any golfer has held the top spot. Johnson is exceptionally skilled in driving and is one of the longest drivers on the PGA Tour. Not only that, Johnson has established himself as one of the PGA Tour's most consistent performers, and he is the first man to win all four World Golf Championship events. With his incredible skills, he has been able to amass a net worth of $50 million. But how did you earn all this money? And let's look at how this professional athlete spends his millions. Dustin earned $70 million in tournament prize money, including the $15 million he had won at the 2020 FedEx Cup title, which places him as the third highest earning golfer after Tiger Woods with $120 million and Phil Mickelson with $92 million. With his winning in 2015, he bought a place in Florida valued at $4.95 million. His estate is located 80 miles north of Miami. The 8,000-square-foot property also features a dock that leads to a small but very private island. The following year in 2016, Dustin sold a property in North Palm Beach for $3.825 million. His house features a wine cellar, pool, swimming pool, and spa. The whole property has 4,500 square feet of space. In 2017, Johnson acquired another property in Florida, the Harbor Isle. He bought the property for $2.9 million, quite a steal, especially considering it was valued at $4.5 million in 2015. The house, Johnson's second in Palm Beach, sits on the Intracoastal Waterway and boasts five bedrooms, six and a half baths, two custom-built walk-in closets, a gourmet kitchen, a cabana bath, home office, and an insulated wine room. The main house has a pool with a waterfall and grotto and three balconies overlooking the water. There's also a four-car garage and a golf cart shed. If you want to get the Dustin Johnson look, you're in luck. Adidas has created a collection where fans can shop his look. Dustin earns $11 million yearly just from endorsements, and he represents top companies like Perfect Practice, NetJets, RBC, Body Armor, Adidas. Dustin is known to be a sharp dresser, and with over 30 designer suits from the brands like Prada and Dolce & Gabbana in his wardrobe, he always looks sharp. The world's number one loves to wear a suit. He has probably 30 suits that each cost three, four, five thousand dollars $5,000, DJ's agent David Winkle told Golf.com. Prada, Dolce & Gabbana, you name it. He also owns a Range Rover. Even with all these earnings, he's no stranger to philanthropic practices. He established the Dustin Johnson Foundation in 2010. The foundation's goal was to help young enterprises who are helping out the young and college programs. The 2021 edition of the DJ World Junior Golf Championship will be hosted by the Dustin Johnson Foundation. All earnings from this event will be given to equipment and scholarships to children in need. Among the many charity golf exhibition games that Johnson has participated in, the latest event that he has participated in was when he partnered with Rory McIlroy to help COVID-19 relief camps. But let's rewind a bit. How was Dustin Johnson's early life, and how did he get into golf? Dustin is the third child of Scott and Candy Johnson. His father is the legendary Scott Johnson, the pro golfer. But being the independent personality, Dustin managed to pick up the sport on his own. During the 90s, his parents were divorced. Dustin chose to live with his father and occasionally visit his mother from time to time. Living with his father taught him a thing or two about golf. From then on, his interest in golf peaked. He picked up the sport early, but became popular after an amazing college career at Coastal Carolina University and graduated from the university with a sports management degree. Fun fact, his brother Austin has been his caddy since 2013. In order to stay strong, perform, and this top-level Dustin stays super fit, let's have a look at his lifestyle. Dustin wakes up between 6.30 and 7, eats breakfast and drinks his morning coffee. For breakfast, he usually eats oatmeal with fruit or eggs. After that, he heads to the gym with his trainer, Joey Diovasalvi. Joey is known to train with various other golfers on the tour, including Ricky Fowler and Brooks Kepka. Dustin spends around two hours a day in the gym. Every day he focuses and trains an individual body part, and he always includes is a core or ab workout. According to Joey Diovisalvi, core is the most important workout for golfers. 
as it helps prevent shoulder and lower back pain. And for these workouts, you do not need any special tools. For many exercises, all they use is a medicine ball, dumbbells, barbells, or a yoga ball. Making it easy as these can all be found at your local gym. With an impressive career, lots of money, and being super fit, it is no surprise that Dustin has a gorgeous wife. The professional golfer is happily engaged to Paulina Gretzky. Johnson quickly became friends with the entire Gretzky clan, long before he even took his future wife out on a date. In 2009, the pro golfer met Janet, the wife of legendary hockey player Wayne Gretzky and Paulina's mother, at the Hero World Challenge tournament. Afterward, the Gretzkys had invited Johnson over for dinner. Dustin had first befriended Paulina's parents and brothers. Three years later, after Dustin and Paulina met at the World Challenge, there was some attraction between the two. They started dating, and they even had a double date with Paulina's parents. That's how it goes in our family, Wayne Gretzky told Golf. Janet and I go out to eat, and we somehow always wind up with seven or eight people at the table. Everyone is invited. According to Golf, the couple has been together ever since. Let's look at his golfing career. To date, Dustin has had an impressive golfing career. Since starting golf in 2007, Dustin has managed one title every season. He now has a tie with Tiger Woods, who has a streak of 14 titles from every season and is slightly behind Jack Nicklaus, who has 17 titles to his name. And he is just a little behind golfing legend Tiger Woods. As Dustin has won the 2016 US Open and the 2020 Masters Tournament, he has won the World Golf Championships six times. Some of the other highlights of his career are, he won his fifth PGA Tour title at the Barclays back in 2011. He beat his competitor Matt Kukar by two strokes. This event marked the second 54-hole tournament achievement of his career. The first was in 2009 at the AT&T Pebble Beach Tournament. Due to the threat of Hurricane Irene, the tournament was cut short. At this tournament, Johnson scored 66-63-65 to win at 19-under. This victory placed Johnson from 19th to 1st at. The FedEx Cup was a highlight in his career as this was his second victory at the FedEx Cup after the BMW Championship. This brought him in the fourth ranking just after Steve Stricker. He started the championships well and continued occupying the number one spot for the first week, but unfortunately wasn't able to hold his form for the last leg of the playoffs, which made him lose, placing at the top 20 in any of the tournaments. And in the end, he can in fourth in the final of the FedEx Cup tournament. And of course, not to forget, at the Masters in 2022 at Augusta National, he scored a 20-under with a 72-hole score of 268, which broke the previous Masters record of 270. An incredible accomplishment. Initially, Tiger Woods had set this record in 1997. In 2021, on February 7th, Johnson won the Saudi International for the second time. It was his ninth victory on the European Tour. In September 2021, Johnson played on a U.S. team in the 2021 Ryder Cup at Whistling Straits in Kohler, Wisconsin. The U.S. team won 19-9. Johnson went 5-0-0 and won his Sunday singles match against Paul Casey. Johnson also won the inaugural Nicholas Jacklin Award for the American team. It is an award given to the player whose teamwork, sportsmanship, performance, and decisions epitomize the spirit of the Ryder Cup. In the end, Dustin Johnson has proved to us and himself to be a highly talented personality of his national golf team full of courage, grit, determination, and dedication when it comes to his golf. Are you a big fan of Dustin Johnson? And how do you think he will perform this season? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to never miss a video from us. That's it for today's video. Thank you for watching.